So we're going to try some light painting pictures like these. And I'm going to quickly show you how to set up your camera for this. So let's go back to here. So first you're going to turn on your camera. Then set this dial to M for manual. And we are going to be using these settings. We're going to use the bulb setting um, for the shutter speed and use the plus or minus to set your f-stop to 8 and your ISO to 400. So this is the plus and minus to be able to set your f-stop. So I'm going to go back here and I'm pressing that and turning this at the same time and you can see that my f-stop will change. I want to put it to 8. And then I've already got this set to bulb, so I'm going to not press this button anymore and just do the rotating um, dial there. And we should... Okay, so as I'm changing the dial, you can see the numbers are changing. That's when it's 20 with the hashtag right here, or whatever you call that, quotation mark. Um, that's 20 seconds, not like a 20th of a second, but we want to go to bulb. So we're going to go here and then to set your ISO, I already have it at 400. There's two ways to do that. You can set your ISO by pressing the function button over here. So you can press this one and when you press the function button, it's going to let you change your um, ISO there. It's hard for me to show you that, but it would be um, using the dial, but you have to use two hands. So you can also go over to menu and you can go on the little camera and then come down to ISO sensitivity by using these arrow keys. So sometimes it'll look like this. I'm going to go up, then press OK over here, press OK again, and then it gives you an option to change your ISO, and 800 will work as well, but let's use 400. <coughs> so that's it. Now you're ready to take your picture. So you're going to go into a very dark room and use some, some type of lights. And then when you press the shutter release, press it uh, gently so it'll focus on the lights. And then press it all the way. Make sure it's on a tripod so it's nice and steady and it'll stay open for a few seconds. Wait to hear the click and then you should see an image pop up on here. And it'll look. You can also press this function button right here. That little arrow that's above the menu. And then you can go on this dial where it says OK to look at pictures left to right. Hopefully you get something interesting.